Good morning again, Bishop Ryan, and good luck to all of our students writing the PISA assessment today. The PISA assessment is an international standardized test that helps evaluate and compare the education systems of different countries around the world. We are excited that Bishop Ryan has been chosen as a sample school and excited that our student participants will be contributing to something on a world scale. The Principal's Advisory Council meets this Wednesday right after school in the conference room. The council is an opportunity for students to meet directly with the principal, that's me, to have all sorts of dialogue about the school. New members are always welcome. Please come to the main office on Wednesday after school if you're interested. We have cancellations today, Bishop Ryan. Uh, Mr. Vitali's period three and period five classes, that's construction technology, grade 11 college level, and construction technology, grade 12 college level slash grade 11 college level and Mr. Lamenta's period one and period two class. That is uh, grade 12 college level slash grade 11 college level construction technology and his period two grade 11 auto class as well. A reminder to those of you with canceled classes, please go to a place where you can do some quiet work. The cafeteria or the library learning commons make excellent choices. And please do choose to work on either meaningful work from your canceled classes or meaningful work for classes from uh, other periods that you have as well. With that, Bishop Ryan, I wish you a great start to the week. And now for more, WRBR. Bishop Brian. I'm Logan. And I'm Daniel. And these are your morning announcements. Happy Celtic Sofa Day. Friendly reminder, we will be out on the periods period three and period four. This message goes out to everyone in the school that's part of a school club or team. Today is Team Photo Day, part two. Mr. Hall has graciously organized extracurricular clubs into a neat schedule that you'll see posted on the TVs following announcements today. Please confirm the time of your club photo and leave class five minutes before your club photo is scheduled to happen. Any concerns regarding your club photo can be directed to Mr. Hall, who will be downstairs shooting for most of the day. To the yearbook committee, please make your way down for, your, for our club photo at 12 noon sharp. Let's make sure to bring our smiles and silliest faces today. To all students in the art club, please make your way down for our art club photo at 11.25 a.m. Be there on time, and also bring your wonderfully silly smiles. Yearbook will hold their weekly meeting tomorrow, as usual, Tuesday in room 120 at 3 p.m. The Writer Circle will be meeting this Wednesday in room 229. All must attend. Another important announcement, the BR's Writer Circle will be meeting in the auditorium today at 11.45 to have their pictures taken. Please wear your t-shirts if you can. See you all there. Now, on to grad with some more announcements. It's LIBO from your grad committee. Up until Friday, you can purchase extra ceremony tickets. Please know that your grad fee already includes two extra tickets. It can be purchased on school cash online for $10. There are limited quantities, so if you're planning on bringing more guests, make sure you check it out as soon as possible. Having said that, Graduation is soon approaching. In exactly 25 days, our dinner dance will start, will begin at six o'clock at Luena Station. Following that, our graduation mass, brunch, and ceremony will begin on Wednesday, June 8th. We've created a Dropbox on the LMS for all memorable photos and videos throughout the last four years. Please make sure to check it out and send us, send us those to be included in our year-end graduation video. Please know that it needs to be it needs to be appropriate and needs to represent Bishop Ryan in a respectful manner. Lastly, outside workroom two is a draft of our class composite photos. If you see any discrep discrepancies, such as your spelling of your name, or simply that's not you in the photo, please let us know as soon as possible. Follow us on our Instagram account, brgrad2022, and check out the LMS page for more details. Please make sure that any outstanding schoolwork is handed in and that you grind your way out to the end. Don't let senioritis get to you. I believe that's all for me, BR. Stay tuned for more WRBR. 
NPR, it's Larissa and Nancy here from UBRC with a few important announcements. Celtics, formal is nine days away. The theme is happily ever after and the dress code is similar to that of a semi-formal, but students may choose to dress in formal or semi-formal attire. Tickets are now officially sold out. The date is Wednesday, May 18th at Carmen's Banquet Hall. See you there. That said, the link for song requests for semi-formal is in our student council link tree in our Instagram bio. The group name is BR-2022-DNC. Enter the code that appears on the page in order to log in. Follow us at Bishop underscore Ryan SC to stay up to date with, incom with incoming information and go make those song requests. That's all from us for today, BR. Stay tuned for more WRBR news. Welcome back, Bishop Ryan. We're here with your sports announcements. In sports news, attention members of the girls' touch football team. There are practices on Tuesday and Wednesday this week at 410. Make sure to bring your own water bottle. Attendance is mandatory. Thanks from Coach Davies. Attention, all members of the senior football team, stop by room 229, periods 1, 2, and 5 to pick up your team hoodie. Thanks, Coach Davies. That's all for from us and have a wonderful day. Good morning, Bishop Bryan. I have an announcement here from Coach Francis uh, regarding some uh, wrestling news from this past weekend. Uh, even though our high school season has ended for the year, we have many of our BR wrestlers as tradition to continue training uh, to compete now in the club level season. And this past weekend was our provincial uh, U17, U19, and U23 provincial championships that were held at Port Credit uh, Arena in Mississauga. And many of our BR wrestlers came back with medals. And I want to congratulate, starting with our oldest U23 members, we had uh, Alyssa Montoya took a silver medal in her weight division. And then we had uh, Serena De Benedetto, who won the gold medal crown, the U23 Provincial Championships on the weekend. And then we, under the U19 division, we had our own Claudia Landry win the uh, gold medal in her uh, weight class, dominating her opponents, uh, be being crowned provincial champion, club champion this weekend. And then in our U17, uh, the, uh, our, our youngest group, uh, we had our big man, Aiden Nadelko Payne dominating every one of his matches, winning the gold medal and winning his provincial title this past weekend. And then it was our girls U17 group that uh, did uh, exceptionally well. We had Katrina Schaefer take a silver medal. And then we had Taylor Engelin who won gold and Ella Delamade winning gold. And our girls U17 for the first time in our club's history won the provincial title. Uh, they came first out of the 30 teams that were there. So congratulations on that outstanding performance. And our last uh, acknowledgement Mr. Francis wants to uh, mention is that we have, um, uh, as you may or may not know, this, past, this coming summer in August is, um, is the Canada Summer Games. It's, a, it's an event, that, a national event that happens every four years. Uh, multi-sport similar to like the Olympic format and uh, last month they had the trials for the Team Ontario women's uh, wrestling program and two of our uh, members uh, won the trials and will be representing uh, Team Ontario this past summer at the Canada Summer Games being held at St. Catharines and they are Claudia Landry and Serena De Benedetto so I wish those two the best of luck this summer as they compete and represent Ontario at this uh, multinational event and for me for the last time I'd like to say uh, have a good day, BR, and back to WRBR. This Wednesday, we'll be welcoming Father David from Our Lady of the Assumption Pairs for our weekly chapel, chapel Mass. This, week, this week's Mass will be on Wednesday, May 11th, during period four. All are welcome to join us. This chaplaincy team are reminded of their group photo today and their upcoming meeting this Wednesday, See Emo for more information. See you at the Celtic Sofa during periods three and four. That's all for WBR today. Have a great day.